As local as local news gets. News 12, The Bronx. Hospital emergency room is busy enough as it is, but imagine trying to explain your symptoms to someone who doesn't even speak your language. Well, a Bronx hospital recognized that, and as our Matt Piper reports, it's now trying to teach its doctors a language they're not used to speaking. Antojos. As if they aren't already in class enough, these medical students are actually taking Spanish classes inside a hospital. St. Barnabas recognized that for more than half the borough, Spanish is the first language spoken. And admittingly, there's a barrier when patients come into the ER and try to explain their symptoms to a doctor who speaks only English. Sometimes they don't want to say something if they're not sure that you're going to understand them or if they don't know how to explain what they're trying to say, so they just don't say it. And that could have been something very important that we needed. Dr. Blanca Grand got the idea last summer and teaches classes every Wednesday during her lunch to resident doctors who are also taking lunch for about 45 minutes. Each week we actually build upon what we learned upon learned last time. Uh, we do the body parts. We actually go through certain questions as to how to interview a patient. As it is, all hospitals have these translator phones where a patient gets on one, explains symptoms to an operator who understands their native language, and repeats it with the doctor on the other phone. These will remain here, but it's the talking face-to-face -face that patients hear, who as it is are nervous to be in an ER in the first place, appreciate. Yeah, that actually happened earlier. The doctor, one of the resident doctors, she was pretty fluent in Spanish, even though the patient came with a translator friend, but she was pretty fluent in her Spanish. Some of the patients that come in, the, the questions we ask them, they don't necessarily feel like they're, you know, they're able to communicate it effectively unless they're speaking to someone that understands what they're saying in their native language. So yeah, for sure, I think that there's a comfort level that they feel. A comfort level that grows in this little hospital office every week. At St. Barnabas, Matt Piper, News 12 The Bronx.